This is the same hallway where last time Tanner captured this green door that I'm highlighting with my flashlight. That green door opened on him and he didn't know. Okay, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No way, no way. This is the room that Ida Gunkel took her own life in. This is Ida's room right here. And then boom, only a couple doors down right here is the door that opened on Tanner last time. Okay, what's even behind this? This looks like it's just like a workshop room. Okay, I just shut it, I shut the door. I'm gonna keep moving. Oh my gosh. This is the kitchen. This is where a lot of people report paranormal activity as well down here in the basement. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sit down. I'm gonna turn on the ovulus. I have the ovulus on. Can someone try to talk to me through this device? Is there really something down here that's non-human? Last time we were here, the door opened. This door to my left. Can you open that door again? I wonder how he's doing right now. Do we even have to go to his walkie works? True. I'm not gonna be the one to check. <laughs> I was gonna say. I'm not gonna walkie scare him. That can be someone else's job. <sighs> I feel like, I already feel so bad. All right, we should see how he's doing though. So I'd like to know who opened that door last time we were here. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I just broke the camera. No, <laughs> We're just uh, checking in, hoping you're doing all right in there. So far, so good. I'm just sitting right between the door that opened on Tanner and Ida's room. Holy crap, okay, well, keep us posted if anything happens. Copy. Oh my god, that scared me so bad. I was not ready for that. <sighs> Think I'm done? Whatever's down here did not want to talk to me on the ovulus. I got lucky. The ovulus didn't give me any responses, but it feels so creepy down there. Every minute that went by, I felt like it was getting worse and worse down there. I don't like the sound of that. No. At all. <sighs> How do we do this? Should we draw? Yeah. All right, let's draw and see who goes next. Oh my gosh, this is so terrible. What? No. <laughs> no way. Why has this happened to me? I freaking drew my name and now you draw your name. This is, karma is so real. Yeah. It is <sighs> real. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm actually scared, but no one should feel bad for me right now. Why? I feel bad for you. You should just tell them. You might as well. Wait, what happened when I was gone? Let's just say you didn't have any karma. What do you mean? Let's just say you had a 100% chance of going in the basement. Did you freaking put my name only in the hat? <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> well then I don't feel bad at all. You get 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 down there. Are you kidding me? Like That's karma. That's even more karma. <laughs> you are a wicked person. <laughs> Walking check. Good, Good check. check. Okay, here I go, and I'm already scared and I'm not even close. <sighs> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. Oh my gosh. Yeah, freaking right. Holy. Okay, I'm 
currently outside of Ida's room. She had a debilitating condition called neurosyphilis and she took her own life right here. And down here is the scariest part of the entire basement. The energy down here is a lot different. It's like incredibly still air. And oh, my heart is pounding out of my chest right now. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sit down. So right now I'm currently sitting outside of Ida's room. The thing about the basement is there are two things that really stand out to me. One of those things is the dark entity down here. What? What? Oh, what? Are you okay? I just heard a lady, like an old grandma lady, say hello. Okay, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming. Go, go, go. What the? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Holy He's crap. He's in the basement. Is there an easier way in? This way, this way, follow. Hurry up! Chelsea? I am here! Where are you? What? Oh. I have not moved. What happened? I am not kidding. I heard a grandma voice. What? what? And you're sitting in front of Ida's room. I'm not kidding. I was I was sitting here. Are you okay? I'm fine. I just I'm freaked out. I understand. That's scary. <sighs> that was scary. It sounds stupid because it's not like a scary noise. I think it's like I'm sad too. You think it was Ida? I don't know what else it could be. It didn't sound like a demon or anything, but it sounded like a grandma. And it sounded like it came from the kitchen. Back there? What? It was like, hello? Is the dark entity down here? Is the dark entity down here? It was almost like the grandma was just calling out to me like dinner was ready or something. It was just like, hello? Like, I don't know, but I have never been so scared in my life. I mean, you're not only in the basement alone, but you're in the building completely alone. I just was not ready for that. Oh my gosh. Let's get Chelsea a breather. Yeah. Are you okay, Chelsea? That's a goalie! Go, 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 go! Let's go! Get out, just get out, get out. Come on, come on! Coming! Go, go, go! Voice. 